What's up everybody? DD Cthulhu here, back at you with another Black Ops 4 video. Today's video is going to be something completely different. It is extraordinarily saddening that I have to make a video exposing someone, but I am at that point to where I need to do so. Yesterday, I went into a team deathmatch on Lair and came across somebody that was using full-on hacks. Not your strike pack stuff, because I have people that I know that have strike packs and stuff, and it just helps with aim and recoil and stuff like that. This guy had every single thing on, except for god mode, so where he couldn't make damage. But I don't get why people have to do this, or even want to. I don't understand why you're so bad at a game you have to do that, because you're not just doing it for fun. Because you, like, it, how is that fun to you? To just go in, be hacking, and trolling. That's not even trolling. To be going around just ruining the game experience for everyone. I don't get why people have to do that. And people always say this. They're not going to do anything. Just because they don't do anything to a specific person does not mean they don't reserve the rights. If you read the terms of service... You can be legally, like, held responsible for hacking using mods on any online gaming service. It's happened plenty of times. Do some Google research. People have been sued for a lot of money. And it's these young kids and stuff still living with their parents and stuff. And then the parents have to suffer. So what we're going to do is we're going to spectate this hacker. And then... You're going to get to see the gameplay of when I started recording after I realized what he was doing. And you're going to see me laughing a lot because I really thought it was sort of kind of humorous that someone would be, you know, that that bad, to be honest. That's just crazy to me. So here we go. We are spectating me. We're going to fast forward, get this match started. All right, here we go. Actually, my mistake. Here we go. Here's the hacker. So, you're going to notice he's playing normally right now. He hasn't turned any of the stuff on. I've never came across this guy before. I don't know who he is. He dies right there. He's still playing normally, so okay, no big deal. He's using a micro MG, you know, no big deal. Checking the corners. Looks like he's playing like a normal player. Destroyed. And then there you go. He just turns it on right then and there. I don't get it. And the worst part about this is it's not even just hyperspeed. He's got aimbot. He's got walls because it's clearly telling him where people are at and or pulling him towards us when he moves. It's just going towards wherever there's enemy players. I, The last video I did, I, did, I decided to delete it. I wanted to go a different route instead of just nonstop being like, oh, this guy's a loser and stuff like that. It's whatever. Um, his PSN is capital N, lowercase Q, E, V, E. Allegedly, he used to be in the Ares clan. I don't know that clan, personally, and I don't care. That's probably why he got kicked off the clan, if he was in one, because he's a dirtball and he has to use cheats because he's that, you know, fucking god-awful at a video game. Um, he... You know, he's not even a smart cheater, too. He's not making it to where he can't get hit. So we killed him plenty of times, regardless of the fact. We just started coordinating. Everybody was just like, what the hell? What's going on? And we were laughing because it just took us by surprise. You know, I, I get the strike pack stuff to where it will help with aim and recoil and stuff. Okay, that's one thing. But damn, this is a whole nother story. You're also going to hear the conversation in the second part when I was, you know, blasting him. He thinks kill, it's funny, kill. and he told me to do a couple seconds of Google research. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I'm supposed to know who he is. 
There's a difference between me and him because I have over 1,400 YouTube videos and some with thousands and thousands of views and stuff. My stuff's all over Google. So when somebody says Google my, you know, Google for a couple seconds, I take it as look my name up and then you're going to see who I am. So I did and nothing pops up. I tried to look up the Ares clan and see if he was ever associated. I can't find anything with that. So I'm, I, I just, I have no clue at this point, but he Googles my name. He's going to find out I pop up all over the place. So the worst part of the entire experience is when he pulls out the purifier right here. It was ridiculous. The weird thing is, the movement is sort of kind of like uh, Doom. It really is. It's like all Doom looking. I was doing my best to stay away and stuff. That's the thing. I started taking unconventional routes, going into water and everything. He was still finding me, which tells you, which absolutely tells you right then and there that this man has something that pulls him towards the enemy. Because he wouldn't just know where everybody's at. Even if you're familiar with the map and how fast he's moving. You know. And to make matters even worse. He was that much of a dickhead. He called in streaks. So it wasn't good enough. You have Godspeed on. It wasn't good enough you have Aimbot. It wasn't good enough that you have walls. It wasn't good enough that you're using all of that, then using your ulti, the purifier, and an offensive operator. You had to call in streaks. Where he will inevitably get caught and, you know, punished is going to be when he starts taking leaderboards. Because if he does this enough, even if a bunch of people... I don't know. Like, let's say this video got a thousand views. If this video got a thousand views and all 1,000 people reported him, yeah, there's probably a way higher probability. There is a clip of this on my Twitter, at uh, DADC, so you guys can see it too. I tagged developers and whatnot. If you guys retweet that, help get this guy a little bit more exposure. So uh, we can get him off the platform and actually i forgot to mention he was with a team and they didn't seem to have a problem with it okay yeah you won but because your fucking teammates a dirt ball and a loser so anybody that was playing with him his teammates they are just as bad as him they're absolute trash bags all of them if you were saying anything other than negative things to the guy that was hacking on your team, you're just as equally as bad. At first, I thought that he had unlimited ammo, but that clearly isn't the case. See what I mean? I was able to kill him, but it's just really hard because the hyperspeed breaks off aim assist. Because it can't handle movement like that. So, uh, I don't care if he ends up seeing this. If you do, uh, f*** you, NQ. You are a massive loser. You are terrible at the game. And, uh, yeah, if you ever want to verse without your hacks, I will live stream me beating the dog shit out of you and dumpstering you. Uninstall the game. You're what's wrong with the COD community. You have to ruin the experience for everyone else. Why? Because you because you can? Just be one of those people in life and do shitty things and always just use the excuse because I can. He wasn't even... He didn't even play any word games. He just... He didn't deny it at all when I called him out on it. It was just like, yeah, so, oh, okay, well, damn. Usually, uh, people cheating at least make an effort to deny it, not just blazingly, yeah, I did it. As you see, I got him again.
So, towards the end, around right here, he turns it off. And then someone shot his body. Let's see who shot his body. Go crazy. My buddy, go crazy. Shot his body. Then he turned his hex back on. Yeah, I'm sorry about theater mode, guys. It is it is what it is. It's not the best thing, but, you know, shit. At least I can spectate this dirt ball from his perspective. And here's the thing, too. You know Call of Duty Black Ops 4 has a theater mode. You know it. Yet you're going to use the most obvious cheats. Like, I don't understand how somebody can honestly be this stupid. And just to make a point to be a dickhead to this guy, I'm probably going to pay for Google promotions and stuff to get this video pushed even harder. Just so people can see him. I'm not responsible. If any of you guys recognize this guy, know this guy, decide to say anything to this guy, I bear no responsibility. I don't want to hear anything. I don't want any messages from him or anybody that knows him saying that he's getting all sorts of stuff done to him. If you see this PSN NQEV E. So NQEVE, -E, back out of the lobby, don't even indulge him. He's just going to do this shit to everybody else. And I can't imagine how many lobbies he has done it to. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, just smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, yeah, whatever you guys do is on you, but I would appreciate it if anybody that has Black Ops 4... Uh, reports this guy, and uh, if you go on my Twitter and retweet the tweet, tagging all the developers and whatnot so we can get this guy off the platform so he stops ruining the game for everybody. Thank you. Till next time. Peace. Yo, I'm recording. I'm recording. I'm recording. I'm recording the match. Your UAV has been destroyed. Dude, he's full on hacking. Holy, he's not even trying to hide it, bro. He's gonna start streaking up. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, I can't believe the hacker! No way! It's a good thing that I'm recording, because... Oh my fucking god! <laughs> no way! This is the fucking craziest shit I've ever seen! Dude, hey, you guys you guys are gonna have to pull out your try-hard classes if we're gonna win. How does he know where we're at? because I'm going to tag uh, Activision on Twitter. Yeah, they are. If you send them footage... They're not f***ing... They're not probably saying anything to them. I'm going to... Them, I'm gonna be like, yeah, you do know I'm a decent sized channel, right? So like if I send this clip in, you're you're because they're doing IP bands now. Yeah. Dude, he's going upstairs. He's upstairs, he's gonna be cross mapping you. 
shit out of <laughs> Oh, that He's he doesn't have he doesn't have he doesn't have god mode like infinite life which is weird Yeah No, he's on it. Yeah, well, okay, he's probably bad without them, or he's probably decent. He just doesn't care. He's doing a. He turned it off. He turned it off. Yeah. Yeah, he does that, and then he's in the United States. I'll use the f***ing security service I use, and I'll sue the f*** out of him. Awesome guys, we get to play against the f***ing hacker. Imagine that. Wow, you're a f***ing douchebag. Imagine hacking last year's Call of Duty game. F***ing douchebag. Yeah, yeah, you're sort of kind of f***ed because I have the whole thing recorded. Yeah, you do know they can sue you for that, right? Yep. Yeah, you sound you sound like a f***ing loser too. You're you're f***ed because f***ing loser. He doesn't even deny it. He just straight up go oh, oh, okay. F***ing idiot. Yeah, and then I'm gonna do the spectate. I'm gonna do the spectate through the theater mode. And then watch your perspective the entire match. And then I'm going to upload that too. So everyone's going to know your PSN. I'm going to upload this shit on Twitter. I'm going to tag Activision. And then they're going to sue the fuck out of you. I don't give a fuck if you're using a strike pack. I know what the fuck you're using. But it's still, you're a fucking pussy. You have to hack on last year's Call of Duty game. Can you imagine being that bad of a player? Oh, I got all the footage I need. You're fucked, dude.